Hi everybody, Miss B here. I am in the potions room at Hogwarts from a store you might have heard of, Harry Potter. In fact, I was lucky enough to get a ticket the, set, uh, the last actually class day of the program in London. So I am walking around the studios with all the actual costumes, props, sets. You can just feel the magic in the air. It is amazing. I'm super excited and I will come back soon with some more awesome footage. to get on the Hogwarts Express. Going immediately to Hogwarts. This is it. We've all made it. We all got our tickets. We all got our acceptance letters. And now I have to figure out which compartment I belong in. I'm hoping to find maybe Lupin sleeping or Ron eating a chocolate frog. This is in order of the movies. They've done each card as it was in the movie for that specific movie. So it's in chronological order, which is incredible. It's so much fun. This is the original and only Hogwarts train that they used for the entire filming for all 10 years of filming. Pretty fly, pretty spectacular. I cannot emphasize this enough. If you haven't read the book or the series, please do. Even if you don't like reading, give yourself something amazing. I promise you will not regret it. Half-Blood Prince. Oh, uh-oh. <laughs> so study really hard because you too want to get into Hogwarts. There's probably nothing more spectacular than getting an acceptance letter and going to platform nine and three quarters to get on your way to becoming the greatest wizard or witch of all time. We're here at the station. It's my cue to go. I have to make sure I don't miss my classes. Have a great time, everybody. Hi everybody, Miss B here. I'm about to enter the Forbidden Forest. Luckily, oh, we have a lot of happy kids. Thank goodness Hagrid's here. We're gonna be okay. Don't be afraid. Especially because Hey everybody, Miss B here. I'm about to go walk through one of the very cool covered bridges that you see in all of the Harry Potter movies. There's gonna be a lot of people in there, so bear with me. Taking a lot of photos. It is very exciting and very crooked. Here we go, so I wanna get in people's way. I feel like I'm at Hogwarts and that Hedwig will at any moment come flying through here to give me a letter. No flying birds yet, but that doesn't mean I'm going to lose hope. If you want to receive letters, you should write letters as well. This is called the Hogwarts Bridge. And there's some fancy filming and people. Oh, some of the original cars that you can recall. Wife, should we read the books? Very exciting. Oh, the chess pieces! Let's see if we can get down there. I'll see you in a minute. Oh. 
Hey everybody, Miss B here. One of my absolute favorite parts of the Harry Potter series is the scene where um, they have to play chess. And here are the actual chess pieces, larger than life. We're lucky that right now they aren't moving, but let me just show you how gigantic they are by standing really close to one. Hi everybody, Miss B here. We are about to go inside uh, number four, Privet Drive. And maybe later on, we'll catch the night bus. Let's see what it's like. Now, as I've mentioned in other videos, this is the exact set, props, and everything. One of my favorite scenes, when all the letters come flooding in the Dursley's house because Mr. Dursley has been trying to stop Harry from getting any letters from Hogwarts. And that is when we get kicked out. And now we get to go and touch a wall like these people. Let's see how it goes. See you soon. Hi everybody, Miss B here again. Here we are outside and we're about to get on. And we're right by for Privet Drive. For those that have read Harry Potter, you know exactly whose address this is. For those that have not, you'll have to read the books to find out. Um, we have some really fun things out here in between the two studios for the tours. And I'm very excited to be sharing it with you. And let's see if we can get a closer look inside the night bus. <laughs> Those beds look pretty comfy. Um, of course they've caged it so we can't go in and get on them because I'd probably take a nap right now. But, We'll have to wait till it opens up to go for a ride later on. Bye, everybody. create the illusion of movement by adding lots of wind and moving the camera in such a way if that's the broom and you want the 
broom to fly past camera, the camera swoops in if you want the broom to appear in shot. Thank you. 